Hello, so today I will be showing you guys my updated shower routine. So yeah, just keep watching. Okay, so let's get right into it. So yeah, my hair is looking very bad. It's in need of me to shampoo it. And this is like my fourth day. Um, so yeah, the first thing I'm going to be doing is rinsing my hair with warm water. This thing is in the way, just let's ignore that. But um, I'm going to be rinsing my hair, make sure it's very thoroughly wet. And I'm going to be using this shampoo by Tressa May in the line Flawless Curls. And actually, this is my first time using the shampoo. I've been dying to using this shampoo and I finally got to use it. And I'm impressed, I really like it. So I'm going to be applying it to my scalp first. I'm going to be really massaging my scalp with my fingers not my nails i don't use my nails to um because it can open any scabs look right here i'm showing you guys i'm using this part of my fingers i'm not using my nails because it's just going to be too harsh on my hair so yeah i'm using my fingers to massage it then i'm going to shampoo the rest of my hair i'm being a little goofy here my son is in the shower in the bathroom with me so that's why i'm being a little extra but um right now i'm just rinsing the shampoo off with warm water as well then i'll be using the shea moisture hair mask and this is actually the first time that i use this hair mask and it's pretty thick as you guys can see in the camera but um i actually am impressed as well with this mask this is the first time that i used it like i said and i really 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 like it so i'm applying some to my ends you want to make sure that your ends have some product because the end the ends is the driest part of your hair just because it's the oldest part of your hair so you want to make sure you put enough product there and all over your hair but make sure your ends have some product then I'm going to pull my hair up in a bun and I'm going to keep it like that for about 25 minutes. You want to make sure that the mask is going to do its job. Since my hair is very short, I'm going to clip my hair back so it can all be up. And yeah, so I'm going to go take a shower. I'm going to shave, wash my face and do anything you need to do in the shower. So once I'm done, that took me about like a, around 5 to 10 minutes. Once I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and take my hair down that way I can rinse the mask off and I'm rinsing it off with still warm water throughout the video you're gonna see a lot of hair around my neck area and my face please excuse that my hair falls out a lot especially after I had the baby so yeah please excuse that so I'm gonna move on to the conditioner by the same line by Tressa May and I'm going to make sure that I apply a good amount of conditioner And I'm going to be using this wide tooth comb to detangle my hair. Although my hair wasn't very tangled because of the whenever I was applying my the hair mask, I actually finger combed my hair, so I didn't have a lot of tangles to detangle. And I just I just put some conditioner on my face, and I didn't notice. So you guys are gonna see that little bit of conditioner throughout the whole rest of the video. So excuse that. So I'm going to be rinsing my hair off using cold water. You want to make sure that the last rinse is with cold water because you want to make sure your hair follicle, follicles close up. And then I'm going to be wrapping my hair up with this cotton t-shirt. And as you guys know, I use a t-shirt to dry my hair. So that's what I'm doing right now. And that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And see you guys in my next video. Bye.